So as you have just told me that you have gone around and seen how the projects are moving and how people are being trained, I think the job you are doing is really commendable. And uh, I can assure you that the tools are needed because many people are poor in the villages and if they are trained and they have the tools to use, for sure you are expecting some changes in their lives in terms of where they sleep, what they eat, what they dress up education and the medication which are for now the basic important needs in the human life. So keep up the good job you're doing. Thank you very much. And and you are Ibra? How long yeah, is it since you were, were training in that organization? Two years. Okay. Two years and three years. And you now have this whole place? Do you employ people? Yeah, they, they have employed some and they are training some of them. Excellent. Really good. So how long is it since you got tools? One year? Okay. Yes. The sofa sets. And they make the big one along the road. Yes, yes. <laughs> okay. The other one is outside. Stand tight. And I'll zoom in to the sofas. Hey, sofa. This is the training centre that the last person we met was trained to, uh, he was trained as a carpenter was he? Yeah. Yeah? Here? Yeah, carpenter. Yeah. Okay. Banana. Okay. Okay. Oops. And then the tools. <laughs> and the things they make.
matter what tea. their trade school in, in their diocese and uh, as you just have uh, heard from Father Nestor actually we appreciate it very much you are tools for life and we need them because they are the tools that make uh, young people uh, get employment and uh, they serve the community so we thank also the team the working team that came <laughs> uh, Judy, Brian and Kiss, we thank them very much, they've been very cooperative and we welcome them again here in Tanzania. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much.